you know, and get a guy like Steve, you know, dominates the basketball the way he does, it's really not a matter of, you know, saying that you're going to shut him down or slow him down or, you know, at the end of the night when you look at the stat sheet, there's still a lot of things that he's going to accomplish because he has the ball. And so it's not really about looking at the numbers per se, but it's it's how, you know, you how you push him, allow him, force him to get uh, to some of those numbers. And Can you even, do you even try to get uh, offensive rebounds or you just have to turn around and run? When the shot uh, no, up? I mean, big guys are big guys that are around the basket, you know, for sure. I mean, it's, uh, you know, it's a, it's a way to slow down teams from running the transition. Yeah. And if we execute our offense, then offensive rebound opportunities are designed to be there without having to, you don't have to necessarily run from 30 feet out to run in and try and get an offensive rebound. Yeah. And um, so that's why we, you know, we talk so much about our offensive execution uh, because it allows us to be better defensively, and you know we've we've done a, a better job of it as the postseason has gone on.